Well, it's uncharted territory for shoppers who have been shut out for months now. Property management at the two malls say cleaning and disinfecting will happen throughout the day, but not all tenants are ready to reopen just yet. A look inside the new normal. Obviously, a lot of things will be different for retailers at two shopping centers in Metro Detroit, but we will be back open for business. Greeted by social distancing signs and face coverings now mandatory. We've removed about 50% of the seating in the shopping center. We've removed all the food court seating. All the restrooms have various signage. We've also created more distance for everybody in those types of areas. We will not operate valet to start with. We will not have a play area to start with. So a variety of things like that through the shopping center, taking away those touch points. Great Lakes Crossing outlets in 12 Oaks Mall will reopen Thursday morning, marking a two month hiatus for retailers and their consumers. The shopping center's operator says they are reopening to help meet the needs of the community. And we're thankful to our tenants who are working through this unprecedented time with us. Um, and there is no playbook in this in this situation. Action News was invited inside 12 Oaks Mall to preview the new safety protocols in response to the next phase of Governor Whitmer's plan to stop the spread of COVID-19 and safely reopen the economy. We understand that there are only 10 customers per store. Uh, we will be assisting them with managing um, the interest in, in shopping again. There's no guarantee all tenants are on board with the reopening and property management encourages you to call ahead before you step out. Maybe 20 to 40 percent that first day and then each day you, you know, new people come on board. Some workers may be reluctant to return and property management says they will assist retailers with that hurdle. The malls will be reopened on a reduced schedule. We have all the details and hours on our website. That's WXYZ.com. In Detroit, I'm Rudy Harper, 7 Action News.